In addition to the win, some families took away some valuable lessons from the game. NBC 4's Eric Halpern is live tonight outside of Lower.com Field. And Eric, that match served as a special experience for some young fans. Carrie, there were people of all ages here tonight, including a lot of parents with their kids who play soccer. And those parents are now hoping their kids take something away from what they saw on the field tonight. Excitement all around Lower.com Field for a World Cup qualifier. United States fans. Go Team USA! And Costa Rica fans. Pura Vida Costa Rica. In Columbus to cheer on their teams. Haven Sanford and her brother Judson play soccer back home in Michigan. They're in town with their dad Greg for the game. This is my first time going to a game like this. Looking around the crowd, a lot of parents brought their kids for the 11th World Cup qualifier game in Columbus and first at Lower.com Field. Eduardo Chavez's son is a goalie. They drove all the way from Maryland. And of course, you know, our culture, we like soccer, so it's good to follow the national thing. They didn't just want their kids to have the experience of an international game. They were hoping they could learn a few lessons, too. I just hope they can see what high-level soccer is like and achieve that for themselves. In New Albany High School girls soccer coach Jared Dombrowski says there are a lot of tips to take home. So much, so much. There's, it's amazing the, the different things that you can learn, whether it's as a player or even as a coach. And tonight's game was a bucket list item for some, and next, they're hoping they can make it to a World Cup game. Live and local for you in Columbus, I'm Eric Halpern, NBC4. Eric, thank you.